Hi everyone. Today I'm back with another video and I have my favorite model with me today which is my mom. I have forced her to sit down and record these videos. Mom, are you excited about this? I'm just being forced. So <laughs> I'm excited. No, you are excited. What do you mean you're not excited? Okay. So, as you can see, this is a natural beauty. Mashallah, she doesn't really need much in general, but I love doing her makeup. It's something that I wanted to also show because a lot of people ask about you know doing their mom's makeup their aunt's makeup and a lot of people somehow i feel that age bracket we tend to just ignore or we don't talk about how they can be enhanced and how you can look beautiful you know way into whatever age that you uh, you know live to so mom in general takes very good care of her health you know she exercises every day since i can remember she always eats in moderation you know she exercises she takes care of her skin so already half my job is done when that happens so i'm taking some pixie glow tonic now and i'm just going to wipe that over her skin i was just telling everyone every time i shoot a video something's uh, happened to my hand i've burnt my hand while cooking if you guys have been watching my insta stories where i'm cooking up all these <laughs> things every day so I burnt my hand so excuse that because every video people ask me ke haat pe kya aapko chot lagi hui hai so i'm just going to wipe that on her face so i like to kind of she already her skin was washed prep like i said she takes very good care of her skin but i wanted to just now add some hydration some glow um this is basically a glycolic acid right so it's like an exfoliator but it's gentle so you can do it right before you do makeup as well now my mom has oily skin uh, rather i've inherited oily skin from her but oh, the great thing about oily skin i feel is that it ages really well hence you know wrinkles etc scent don't set as much as they do on normal or dry skin but even then i'm constantly looking for um hydration for my skin even though i have oily skin mom does the same so moisturizing is really important especially because i feel agar aap dekho to skin jaise age hoti hai zara dry lagne shuru ho jati hai aur bahut log powder aur thick foundations laga ke usko aur bhi dry uh, you know bana dete hain so the idea is no matter what the age skin ko glow karna chahiye hai bahut dewy lagna chahiye hai moisturize lagna chahiye hai achhi tarike se aapne apna moisturizer laga liya agar ye nahi a lot of people also ask ki products aap laga rahe hain to hamare paas ye products nahi hain to jo uske kareeb aapke paas products hain aap usse bhi ye looks create kar sakte ho the idea is ki aap technique seekh rahe ho jab main aapko ye videos करके दिखा रहे हैं ऑल्सो मेक श्योर के चेस्ट और नेक क्योंकि इन द एंड वंस इन हर फिनिश लुक शी इज गोन वेर अ साड़ी तो चेस्ट भी दिखेगी सो आई रियली अप्लाई अ नाइस थिक लेयर ऑफ मॉइस्चराइजर गोनो अप्लाई सम कील्स अवकाडो आई ट्रीटमेंट क्योंकि अगेन फाइन लाइन एज द स्किन एजेस मेकअप सेट ज़्यादा हो जाता है फाइन लाइन इंक्रीज होती हैं तो आपने मेक श्योर करना है कि आप अंडर आई पे भी ये क्रीम अच्छी तरीके से मॉइस्चराइज करें I'm also going to apply just a little bit on her lid. Are you excited when I do your makeup? Honestly, yeah, it's, it's yeah, it's, it's always I enjoy it. I get to learn so much each time you do my makeup. Mom, that's so cute. I I learned from you, you know. She said she does not tell me. I find out that she does not make up. Mom, what secrets do I not tell? You? I tell you everything. Ami is always thinking कि मेरे कोई conspiracy है मैं जब खालस के साथ में बैठती हूँ और सारी उनको products के बारे में बताती हूँ तो Ami कहती है कि मुझे कुछ नहीं बताती है और सिर्फ अपनी खालस को बताती है. That's true. Mom, it's not true, but it's something that my mom believes. So now I'm going to mix two foundations and I'm going to use two colors from the Maybelline Age Rewind. And I'm going to take a Morphe brush here. I'm just going to mix those two. Just going to cover the inner corner of her eye and the top part of her eye. Because I'm going to do her eyes first, and I'm going to do her skin in the end. Again, very gently. A lot of times, guys, I see this a lot in videos where people hold people's head like this and head like that. When I was working in Mac, one of the things I, I remember my trainer used to come and like kind of tap our hands when I was holding heads. So. the client should want to sleep you should never make them like i always say make your clients sit straight up as you can see i never make them lie down there should be no pulling pushing of the head um, you know uh, you know eyes also sometimes people do this and people do that i find that to be very ridiculous so it should be very light if you pull very very light these are just basic 
things that I was I was taught in makeup school and while I was with Mac at that time. So our trainers used to always say that you never hold people's head. I see this a lot too. People come and when they're doing makeup, they literally put the entire weight on a person's head. It's the wrong thing to do. It shouldn't happen. So I'm just making sure I'm covering her entire eye area. She's going to be wearing a grey sari today that I've selected and uh, you know really pretty jewelry with it yeah, it's like a grayish yeah it has like, like a grayish green tone you guys know if you've been watching my videos I don't do eye makeup without my you know gel eyeliners so I'm going to take some of it on my brush and I'm going to apply it inside the waterline with the same dip down and I'm going to just gently also go under the eye with that and then I'm going to build the same dip down very gently on top of her eye as well. So what are your tips for great skin as you age mom? Because a lot of women ask how does your mother's skin look so good and I always say it's not so much the creams you put but the lifestyle you have and she's always gone to bed early, you know, she exercises every day no matter what. I've never seen you eat the way <laughs> me and Sabrina can eat. <laughs> you eat in moderation. So what are, what are the tricks? What would you say? Uh, drink lots of water, like you said, sleep early, wake up early. I try to, cleansing is very important. So if you apply makeup, make sure uh, that you take it off very properly. Make sure you use lots of products and you cleanse a couple of times because um, in your terrace, you have makeup, you have done the key to the thing. It's important to look in the face to soften and so it's very important as well. Do eat uh, good nourishing food, have juices, have less greasy food, and exercise. That helps, yeah. I'm just going to use the Too Faced uh, Maple from this palette. So again, guys, if you pull the eye, never do this. Like It should be never harsh. It should be very gentle. Okay, close. I'm just going to now blend this very gently. I'm doing it more towards her crease to define that crease. Working on skin that's mature is that on the eye there is, you know, lines, fine lines, a slight wrinkling, etc. So the idea is to diffuse everything. Aapne usko blend karke diffuse karna. Agar aap usko bahut precisely eyeliner lagane ki koshish karenge, to wo uneven lagega. Isliye hum har cheez ko blend karenge, buff karenge, ki wo seamless bhi lage aur hamari jo flaws hain kisi ki face pe wo highlight nahi karne. So, pehle main matte eyeshadows ke saath, I'm just going back and forth. Crease ko mazra dark karein. Isi palette se truffle use karungi Too Faced ki, and I'm going to now just make the waterline eye ki darker. Usko mazra smudge karein back and forth. Because remember, again, agar aap ispe ek bahut fine line kar create karne ki koshish karenge, to wo uneven lagega. Aapne koshish karni hai ki aap jo eyeliner lagayenge, usko aap smoke out karenge. Thoda sa blend karenge powder ke saath. कि जो पूरी आंख है वो डिफ्यूज्ड और ब्लेंडेड लगे जितना आप स्ट्रक्चर क्रिएट करने की कोशिश करेंगे बहुत डिफाइन करने की कोशिश करेंगे उतना ही वो अनइवन लगेगा तो यू हैव टू मेक इट मोर डिफ्यूज्ड एंड आई एम जस्ट गोइंग टू अमा ओपन मैं रूट ऑफ द लास्ट के अंदर जाके ये लाइनर लगा रही हूं तो इसको मैं थोड़ा सा एजेस से लिफ्ट करेंगे हल्का सा बिकॉज़ अगेन आईज को लिफ्ट करने की भी जरूरत है बिकॉज़ एज वी एज contours tend to go down a little bit तो आपने अगर बिल्कुल आप लाइन को फॉलो करेंगे तो वो जरा नीचे हो जाएगा आपने हल्का सा उसको ऊपर ड्रॉ करना है नो टेप्स गाइस अ लॉट ऑफ यू पुट स्कॉच टेप्स एंड ऑल ऑफ दैट इट्स सो रिडिकुलस आई लाफ एवरी टाइम आई सी अ स्कॉच टेप हियर प्लीज डोंट डू स्टफ लाइक दैट स्पेशली इफ यू वांट टू बी अ मेकअप आर्टिस्ट इट्स इंपॉर्टेंट टू इंप्रूव योर टेक्निक और टेक्निक टेक्निक इंप्रूव करने के लिए आपने खुद इसको बार-बार जितना आप करेंगे जितनी आप प्रैक्टिस करेंगे टेक्निक इंप्रूव होगी ठीक है तो हल्की से मैंने नीचे दिखा के आपने हल्का सा साइड से लिफ्ट किया तो इफ यू नोटिस इफ यू फॉलोड हर ओन नेचुरल लाइन आईलाइनर यहाँ आता पर मैंने वो नहीं किया मैंने इसको थोड़ा सा ऊपर लगाया जस्ट स्लाइटली इतना ऊपर भी नहीं करना कि आंख बिल्कुल कॉकाइड लगने शुरू हो जाए आई सी दर अलॉट टू पीपल ड्रॉ टू टू हाई एंड दर ऑल्सो हैपन्स वेन यू फोर थिंग्स लाइक स्कॉच टेप टू ड्रॉ योर लाइन्स ओके और स्पेशली यू नोटिस कि जैसे मिचो आइज पे मेकअप करोगे तो आप नोटिस करो कि डिफरेंस ज़रा ज़्यादा होता है आँख में थोड़ा सा फ़र्क होता है उसको बैलेंस करना बहुत ज़रूरी है 
I did mum's makeup for that interview that uh, mama and khalas did for nano ki death anniversary and itne requests aaye the ki aap ye tutorial zarur kare so i thought i would definitely do makeup looks on mum niche dekhna aap to main sirf corners ko agar abhi aap notice karoge main eyeliner se corners ko thick kar rahi hu because main aankh ko lift karna chahti hu i want to give a lifting effect to the eye especially like i said as we age contours tend to go down i want her eyes to lift to main unko zara lifted tarike se kar rahi hu ki aankh ke front se eyeliner hum thin rakhenge niche dekhna mamma i'm just going to now place the eyeliner here also front se line aap thin rakhenge aur side ho se thick karenge कि आंख की जो साइड्स हैं वो लिफ्ट हों राइट जब वो नीचे देख रहे हैं नीचे देख रहे हैं आप तो फोल्ड दिख नहीं रहा जब आप आंख खोलेंगे खोलो तो यहाँ एक फोल्ड है जिसके अंदर मुझे थोड़ा सा और थिक करने की अब ज़रूरत पड़ेगी नीचे देखना मम्मा विच इज़ अनदर रीज़न जब लोग लोगों को लिटा के मेकअप करते हैं मुझे समझ नहीं आता कि अगर आप आँख बंद करके लिटा के मेकअप करोगे तो आप ये नहीं देख पाओगे कि जब वो आँख खोल करके रेगुलरली आप आँख बंद करके तो नहीं सबके सामने आओगे राइट सो यू ओपनिंग यू आए ये देखना बहुत ज़रूरी है कि आँख खो खोल के मेकअप कैसे लग रहा है नीचे देखना मम्मा सो टेकन माई टाइम आई कैन मेड माई जनरल गाइडलाइंस अभी ये गाइडलाइंस है अभी इस पर पूरा मेकअप होगा पर मैंने अपनी आँख नीचे लिफ्ट की है I'm going to take some truffle now, and I'm just going to blend that color out. So I'm creating that weight on her eye. So, I mean, especially I feel the one thing, the one rule with uh, against uh, eyes that are more mature is that you, as much glittery, metallic colors, you will use, or a very shiny, some surface, you will use. So, the eye will be highlighted with wrinkles or fine lines. We have to generally work with matte, and then just to highlight, I will add some metallic in there. But you want to stay away from anything that really highlights the fact that there are fine lines. So, आपने उनको blend और buff करना है बजाय ये कि highlight कर दें. तो जो मैं अभी करने की कोशिश कर रही हूँ आपने matte shadows के साथ करना है. अगर आप इसके साथ shimmery shadows के साथ करने की कोशिश करोगे, you actually won't get the effect that you're looking for. And I'm going to just take some of this and blend it with a tad bit of that. And now, from the corner of her eye. to the middle of her eye i'm just brushing this again to make make her crease more prominent maine corner of the eye se leke half way tak shade kiya can you see wo ekdam prominent ho gayi hai crease jitni crease deep or prominent lagegi utni hi aankh lifted lagegi cuz remember like i said mature eyes pe ye jo area hai ye bhi drop hona shuru ho jata hai to agar aap wo nahi kare denge structure aankh ko to wo लिफ्टेड और हैवी नहीं लगेगी राइट सो आई एम गो बैक हेयर कैन आई बैलेंस द अमाउंट दैट आई पुट ऑन द अदर साइड आई एम टेकिंग ट्रफल एंड मेपल ओनली फ्रॉम द पैलेट सो आई एम जस्ट गोना टेक सम अ फ्लैट ब्रश हेयर एंड आई एम जस्ट गोना स्टार्ट क्रिएटिंग सम ऑफ दैट कलर इन द सेंटर ऑफ हर आई सिर्फ सेंटर में रखेंगे हम ज़्यादा उसको कोनों में नहीं लेके जाएंगे लाइक आई सैड दैट्स गोना हाईलाइट फ्लॉज एंड वी डोट वो डू दैट वी वोट रेडी इनहानस दैट आई सो आई एम जस्ट कीपिंग इट टू द सेंटर I'm just I haven't wet the brush it's just a dry brush main aista aista isko layer kar rahi hu aapne tap karna hai again i keep repeating this guys none of this and none no rough if you notice my videos it happens when i do live tutorials as well i always tell the girls do you see my hands doing very hard motions koi aap bahut hard motion dekh rahe nahi softly aapne aur bahut dafa mere clients bhi mujhe kehte hain jab main makeup kar rahi hoti hu ki we were going to sleep while you were doing the makeup because it was that gentle and that's how it should be now i'm going to darken her liner area a little bit more jo aankh ki koi bhi jahan droopiness hai ya lines hain wo utni hi kam lagengi the more you kind of blend it out smoke it out because a lot of people also complain ki jab hum apni mothers pe ya aunts pe makeup kar rahe hain liner bilkul perfectly nahi lag raha wo kyunki jo base structure hai eye ka us pe lines hai to of course it can't be like putting just one black like line and that's it that's not the way to approach it aapko buff or smoke out karna padega jaise main ye line yahan kar rahi also a lot of people start opening the eye like they'll start pulling at the eye and stuff dekhiye the problem with doing that is ki yahan to maine pull kiya to ho gaya but once the eye is back to normal 
आप सारी रात ये तो नहीं करते रहेंगे ना मैं इसलिए एडवोकेट नहीं करती कि आप खींचें और मेकअप करें इस बिकॉज आप आँख का कंट्रोल चेंज कर रहे हैं और उसके हिसाब से मेकअप कर रहे हैं और जब आँख वापस अपने रेगुलर जगह पे जाएगी तो फिर वो करेक्शन नहीं हुई होगी सो एम जस्ट गोइंग टू जस्ट अप्लाई सम ऑफ दैट देर इज वेल So we're going to use this lash by Lorella that's just uh, launched in Pakistan. I'm going to use it in the style Swish. It's nice and flirty. Let's get these on Mum. Mum has a big eye so usually I don't have to cut it more than a little bit. Open Mum. Yeah, that's going to fit. So abhi maine glue ke baghair you can see I just placed it on her eye just to see how it's going to look. No matter what their age I don't prefer a very very heavy lash so stick to st soft kind of flirty lashes with this is a great another way of just opening up the eye making it seem more alive so lashes are another favorite thing that I do apply always make sure ki the person is looking down i've used some huda beauty black glue and i'm going to now slowly attach this to her eye now let her just eye calm down i'm going to go back in with a black gel eyeliner inside her eye and i'm going to use some black gel eyeliner now and go into her waterline i'm also going to go in the inner corner here thoda sa just to define that the reason why i like this bent kind of eyeliner brush is that i can go easily in the corner and i'm going to go over where we've applied her lash to cover this strip and also darken the area right next to her lash line The good thing about making my guideline before is that I already know where the wing of that eye is going to go. So I feel like जो पहले मैंने brown के साथ time लगा के वो measure करके रख लिया था उससे मेरा eyeliner लाइनर जो मैं फिनिशिंग लाइनर लगा रही हूँ दैट बिकम्स एन ईजियर थिंग टू डू कैन यू सी हाउ लवली दैट लाइन इज नाउ लुकिंग तो अगर आप इसको पहले से लगा देते और आप नीचे वो सारी ब्लेंडिंग नहीं करते तो ये इफेक्ट नहीं आता विच इज़ वाई जो आप स्ट्रक्चर नीचे बनाते हैं और लॉर्ड ऑफ पीपल आज के आपकी अम्मी का आई मेकअप इतना वो स्टाफ कैसे लग रहा है हम करते हैं तो नहीं होता है इट्स बिकॉज यू रियलाइज कि जो नीचे हम स्ट्रक्चर बनाते हैं जो एक बेस बनता है उससे बहुत फर्क पड़ता है जस्ट टेकिंग एनी रेजिड्यू फ्रॉम द इनर कॉर्नर आउट एंड आई वो वेट माई ब्रश एंड अप्लाई दैट ग्रे आई शारो इन देंटर अगेन ओपन यूल नोटिस वन शी ट्राइज टू क्लोज आई आई टेल टू ओपन आई बिकॉज अगेन वो ही बात हो जाती है आँख बंद के साथ जब वो प्रेस करेंगी तो मुझे इतना अच्छा नहीं सही तरीके से नहीं दिखेगा कि आँख कैसे लगेगी जब वो खुली हुई होगी तो मैं हमेशा आँख खोल के उन्हें कहती हूँ कि नीचे देखें आई एम मेकिंग इट स्ट्रॉन्ग नाम टेक सम ऑफ माई ट्रफल फ्रॉम द सेम पैलेट ऊपर देखो एंड जस्ट मेक द अंडर आई डॉक बिकॉज आई वॉन्ट दिस टू बी स्लाइटली हैवी आई सो एम जस्ट मेकिंग दैट डॉक ऑल द वे अंडर नाम गोन गो ओवर हर आई लाइनर अगेन विद ट्रफल इज वेल जहाँ आई लाइनर लगाया उसके ऊपर मैं ये लाइनर की लाइन ब्लेंड कर रही हूँ जितना ब्लेंड करोगे उतना ही वो एक सॉफ्ट ब्यूटीफुल इफेक्ट देगा और जो फाइन लाइंस हैं वो इन्हांस नहीं होंगी दिल ब्लेंड इन टू द आई सो दिस इज अ ग्रेट वे ऑफ मेकिंग योर आई लाइनर सीम मोर स्ट्रक्चर्ड एंड ब्यूटीफुल व्हेन यू हैव अ चैलेंज वे यू हैव लाइंस ऑन द आई सो आई एम जस्ट गोन गो ओवर द आई लाइनर वन मोर टाइम शी जस्ट चेंज इन टू हर साड़ी एज वेल आई एम जस्ट गोइंग ओवर द लाइनर So I'm just going over it, balancing it, and I'm going to take some carbon eyeshadow by Mac, just shading that in the corner of her eye, light touch, just softly. So I'm just darkening that corner of her eye because we want this to be a lovely kind of grey smoky eye. So I'm just slowly creating that smoke, and I'm just going to blend this black. Going outwards with this shadow. So, जहाँ हमने black लगाया उसको मैं sideों पे ये maple से लेके blend कर रही हूँ कि उसकी transition सही हो. And I'm gonna take some nylon eye shadow by Mac and apply it on her brow bone. And now I'm gonna close, Mama. 
on top of this eyeliner just go over once with this shadow as well open so i'm just wiping around her eyes and face and i'm gonna first take my illuminator and i'm going to apply that over her face chest just using a morphe brush again it's like a buff brush here just using that on a lip also i'm just gonna apply it everywhere and like i said a lot of people like put too much product and especially on mature skin you have to remember the more cakey it looks the more they look like they have age on their side so you want to make them look nice and dewy and you know glowy so i'm going to apply that to the T zone of her face and not go towards the outer side of her face. I just want it to be on her T zone, and I'm going to take a little bit and apply over the normal under her eye also. We'll do the finishing of the eye after we're done with the skin now. So just giving that a break for a minute. So I'm going to take some Fenty Beauty. This is unattached. I mix this in her concealer. I'm going to take some Tarte Shape Tape in medium and some Tarte Shape Tape in light medium and some Born This Way in light. Just a little bit of that. This is Sephora brush number 80 and I'm just going to mix these with a little bit of the Fenty lipstick. You can take any other liquid lipstick that's similar to this color. And I'm going to apply it to the dark areas. Mom doesn't really have pigmentation other than around her eyes. So I tend to just use it there. It helps to neutralize the darkness under the eye. So I'm going to go under her eye here, making sure that we're covering all the darkness, even in the inner corner, a little bit I've gone. So we cover that area also. Right, just a little bit around the mouth. Otherwise, this is all the discoloration she tends to have is around her eye area. So we've neutralized that as you can see, right? Just doing another quick layer. And the trick is to let this dry before we do the next step. So I'm just going to let this dry for a minute, one whole minute. So not like 30 seconds and let it go. Just for a minute, we're just going to let this dry because you want it to really set and kind of hold on to the skin before we go to the next step. So now I'm going to take my highlighter and mix it with the BB Cream Anti-Fatigue by Bourjois. And I'm using light and I'm also going to mix some dark in it. So a little bit of dark from the same BB cream and a little bit of light. So I'm going to now use my buff, this buffing Morphe brush and start applying it on her face. Mom is really petrified that I will apply this on her sari, so she keeps reaching for it. <laughs> I mean, I've told her I she won't. She promised me not to spoil my sari, so. I won't, promise. So I'm just packing that into her skin. I'm going to take my beauty blender now and start pushing this into her skin. So look up, Mama. So pat, 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 pat. Mom loves the way I do her skin, by the way. Mom said, please tell them. Yeah. And she's always like, what have you put? You haven't told me. Then she takes all the products she sees me using and then she does it herself as well. She's actually, I mean, she's the reason why I even got into makeup because all my life it was my dream just to stare at her when she did her makeup. And it's so funny that now it's like my mom owns five makeup products and does hates doing her own makeup and she wants me to do it for her. It's an easy way out. Yeah. But you used to remember how I remember you used to do everybody's makeup. Yeah. Mom was like the makeup person. I did everybody's makeup. All my cousins, I did their bridal makeup. Although I had no training at that, because I was very young myself. I used to love doing people's makeup. Yeah, yeah. All, uh, growing up, everybody like used to come to you. You were like the makeup 
person to go to in the family yeah and now it's it's funny that mama's like asking me i always still get a little like oh god he's asking me so last time i'd gone to her room and i remember being like mama we were shooting a she had shoot a tutorial for her channel which you guys must subscribe to if you're watching this it's hina durani um and i remember she was going to shoot for her channel and i she was going to do like a bronze eye so i told mom you know uh take her a bronze eye shadow and she was like i don't have a bronze eye shadow since so went and saw her uh drawer of makeup and i was appalled by the, <laughs> the fact that mama didn't even have i think three eye shadows so i read i she's so used to now me doing her makeup that uh, even the stuff that she buys i end up taking from her because she doesn't use it i become lazy So can you see how that BB cream mixed with that highlighter how lovely her skin's looking it's just looking nice and glowy it's not like thick pancake or foundation i hate that look which is so common here um and a lot of people request it as well because they're so used to it but it's actually does more uh, damage than it does good so i'm very 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 uh, anti that i'm taking my smaller beauty blender and i'm applying that towards her they come i'm now going to start working on under her eye to take that tinge of like reddish tone there we have because of the lipstick we mixed in which really helps in neutralizing any darkness so we want to make sure that we're really getting in there and so i'm just going under her eye again up again just blending that in making sure the under eye is nice and bright the eye cream and the mixture that i applied under her eye really helps in not letting these lines under the eye set having said that there's no such thing as no lines i think now because of social media and filters and general photoshopping etc people believe that somehow your face should have no lines but of course to a certain extent it'll have lines but it should be soft and subtle they shouldn't be like deep creases being set and looking like it's dry it should be just really soft natural creases even if they form which they will because we're human and we have uh, folds and creases on our face but we should try to make them look as soft and you know minimize them as much as we can when we're doing makeup here Open and look down. I'm just going to do the inner corner of her eye again because mom was watering, and water comes and kind of ruins the inner corner the most. So I'm just going back in with that. Keep looking down right now, mama. Just turn this way a little bit. Down again. So mom's got this lovely kind of a brown. I mean, I wear brown contacts on my eye, but she naturally has a really brown eye. It's very similar to Nana's actually. Nana had like a light brown eye. Uh, my Nana side of the family has a lot of coloured eyes, and mama, even uh, mama's youngest, my younger sisters have green eyes. So I feel like colour on her eye immediately brings out that tone, and I really love that when I do her makeup. Over this now. So these browns and even this. Gray is really going to highlight that color, and I'm going to now paint on her contouring. You'll notice a lot of times people tend to just look here, mom. A lot of people tend to draw it here. I'm just going to show you guys the difference. Okay? Can you see where I've applied it? So if you look straight, can you see how the cheek that I've applied higher contouring on her face looks like it's being raised? So another mistake people make a lot of is that you actually make your line a lot lower. So this is her cheekbone. This is where the hollow is, but you have to paint it on top, not make this look droopy. So the idea is to shadow this particular entire area. Because jitna ab high rakhenge, again, uh, yeah, as when you're younger, all your contours are higher. As we age, they tend to fall down. So if you don't contour a face correctly aap usse bhi unki age actually increase kar sakte hain theek hai um main isko sides of the nose pe bhi laga rahi hu and i'm just going to do her hairline a little bit as well 
मम हैज अ हार्ड शेप फेस सो हार्ड शेप फेसिस पे यहाँ हेयर लाइन पे हल्की सी एंड अब वर्किंग सम जस्ट क्रिएटिंग दैट शेडोज ऑन अर फेस सो इट्स ऑलवेज अंडर एंड देन यू हैव टू शेड हेयर इज वेल सो इट्स नॉट जस्ट अ लाइन अंडर योर चिन आपने इसको अंडर की चिन की जो साइड है उस पर भी ब्लेंड करना है I'm just really blending that into her foundation. Right now, I'm going to take my beauty blender and blend these areas. In these areas, we are going to dab the beauty blender. Because you have placed it, you are just blending. So there's no need for again too much of moving of. Sponge etc. and start creating her brow um you may want to do the basic structure for this cuz you do your eyebrows a lot so some things i know i leave to mom because she does her lip liner and her eyebrows Now I'm taking some almond concealer again and I'm going to go around her eyebrow. I'm also going to take the same color down to the center of her nose. I'm also going to apply it with the brush to the corner of her eye to kind of make this area like up the contrast. Ke wo contrast jab high hoga to और भी जो आई मेकअप है वो प्रोनाउंस होगा और मैं वही आमंड से पैक कर रही हूँ थोड़ा सा डैप 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 करके सेंटर ऑफ अ फोर हेड ऑल्सो स्टिल यूजिंग द सेम आई एम ऑल्सो जस्ट ब्लेंडिंग बट आई अप्लाइड द कंसीलर ओवर हर आईब्राउ वहाँ भी हम थोड़ा सा ब्लेंड करेंगे एंड आई एम टेकिंग द आवर ग्लास पाउडर है एंड आई एम जस्ट को स्टार्ट buffing that into her skin jo thin powders hain wo lagane hain cuz like i said we don't want to cake it up we want her makeup to still read very dewy to main concentration jo powder ki hai wo main t zone pe rakhungi upar dekha hu also this area i'm going to make her wear jewelry right now to agar aap yahan powder nahi lagate to fir wo jewelry bhi मेकअप को जरा स्मज करती है तो वी वॉन्ट मेक श्योर कि ये भी एरिया इज पाउडर आई वो मेक अ वेयर ज्वेलरी नाउ दिस इज अ ब्यूटिफुल नेकलेस बाय जयपुर एंड को हु सेंड मी सम स्टनिंग ज्वेलरी सो यू गैज वुड बी सींग द जूल्स इन द वीडियो जस्ट गो नो गो इन द कॉर्नर्स नाउ डार्क इन दो स्पेशली जब हम अपने कंसीलर uh, कर लेते हैं तो जो नीचे प्रोडक्ट लगता है वो यूजली हल्का सा टच करना पड़ता है रीअप्लाई करना पड़ता है ना आई गोन टेक सम ऑफ माय ब्लश आई लाइक लॉट्स ऑफ ब्लश या माम इज लाइक अ ब्लश पर्सन सो इवन ऑन ब्राइट जमी वुड ऑलवेज बी लाइक मो ब्लश मो ब्लश सो माम लव्स ब्लश इवन ऑन माय फेस शी इज ऑलवेज कंप्लेनिंग सेइंग योर फेस लुक्स सो पेल बिकॉज यू डोंट पुट इन ब्लश ऑन ऑन just making her cheeks nice and rosy now i'm going to take my liquid highlighter again and i'm going to apply it on my beauty blender and now i'm going to go over this area very delicately cuz i know i've already powdered it but i tend to do this in the end cuz there's a layer of powder sealing everything under and you have to make sure the brush the sponge isn't too wet cuz you don't want to take product off just lightly to add some shine all over 
and here I'm using the Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Filter in number two as my highlighter. Just dabbing it everywhere. Smile mark. And this is kind of like a hybrid, like some people, you can put this product without makeup also, under makeup and on top of makeup. And it gives a nice kind of dewy sheen to the face. I'm going to add one more layer of the blush now. So this is another thing that mom does herself. She's going to pencil her lips because she's so used to doing it herself. Now I'm going to mix Meher and Pink Plaid by MAC. These are two of the pinks that I use a lot of and they're really popular colors. I mean, if you're a makeup person, you've heard of these. So I love mixing both of these to create a lovely cool toned pink lip. Lips together and smile again. So I'm just mixing that, blending that in with the pencil so it doesn't look like it's separate from the color. I'm going in with Max Saint No Angel Lip Gloss. I'm going to apply that on her lips because again, glossy, dewy. I feel it's all of it together. It both fresh and young look. I don't like makeup that looks dry and cakey on anyone but especially when you do uh, you know our beautiful moms and aunts and you know again on mature skin i feel like and features they kind of get they look older if you get do very cakey very dry kind of makeup so here we have it now i'm going to go in with my roller lash mascara by benefit look down and just darken the corners a little bit more for the finishing of the eye now that we can see the entire look it's easier to see how dark you want to go so i tend to do this right at the end i'm going to make the corners a little more smokier so corner where you have your liner and then slightly up so it looks like that crease has gotten more defined So I'm going to use this gunmetal grey from this palette and I'm going to mix it with the silver a little bit. I'm just trying it on my hand and then right in the center, I'm going to dab that a little bit. So close. A lot of times um, people want to have come, some kind of shimmer happening on their eye. So this is a great way of adding shimmer open without making it seem like the eye is uh, again like it's cakey etc. This end kind of touch of shimmer. Uh, that one would give as opposed to applying glitter so i do love this palette and the eyeshadows in it to just kind of add that last kind of end those touch of oomph to the eye i'm just going in the center as i said open mom i'm going to seal her makeup with the makeup forever mist and fix close mom So now, as you can see, this gorgeous dewy look on my stunning mother. It does help that she is naturally so stunning as well. But I hope I've shown you guys today how you can have fun with makeup for women that are over a certain age. Old is gold. Women look beautiful whatever age they have experienced. Their life's entire story, I feel, shows on their face. So we should celebrate that, not mask it. I feel like there's a certain kind of makeup that people tend to just kind of bracket older women in. I've tried to show you guys how if you create the right structure and you make sure that you're giving it a solid foundation 
here I've used even shimmers, I've used gloss, I've used a lot of highlighting on her face, on her eyes. But the reason why it works is because we used the right techniques and minimized anything that we wanted to hide and we've kind of accentuated all her great assets. So I hope I've taught you guys something today. Uh, please keep liking, sharing and subscribing and leaving your comments under the videos. I'm listening to you guys and uh, please let me know how you love this look.